The following contest is scheduled for one fall. And it's for the Love Pro Wrestling Tag Team Championships. You are refereeing for this title bout, PPW Senior Official, Curtis Barnum. Good luck to Curtis Barnum trying to keep order in this one. Right. Now it might be worth pointing out. Making their way to the ring first, your challengers. Might be worth pointing out as the challengers make their way out. We've had two championship matches thus far, and no titles have changed hands. I'm interested to see if Nicole Matthews and artist Artemis Spencer can sort of turn the tide for the challengers. Representing the Lions Gate Dojo, Nicole Matthews took on Speedball Mike Bailey last night in a losing effort. We haven't seen Artemis Spencer. To be fair. I say this as someone who has Nicole, known Nicole Matthews for longer than I've known my husband's people, Mike Bailey. She she barely lost. It was kind of a fluke situation. I would like to see a rematch. It was a hard fought contest, and I would absolutely like to see that mixed up again. It's definitely right. We have not seen Artemis Spencer in LPW and ring for champions. quite some time. Always great to have him back, but they are in tough against the LPW Tag Team Champions. Ride or die, Steven Crow down 10 pounds of gold after last night's ladder match. You can bet he is clinging with a death grip to the tag team titles flanked by the leader of the clandestine society, Michael Richard Blades. Show some respect. That's our savior, God's gift to wrestling. Representing the Fantastic Society, Stephen Crow, Terrence Brown, Terrence Crow, Rose, Oh, God! And you have to bet Stephen Crow nodded 100%. Nicole Matthews, she was here last night. She saw it. She knows. Perhaps Terrence from accounting have to do some of the extra heavy lifting tonight, but Stephen Crow never wanted to shy away from a fight. Ryder Dye has been asking for competition. They keep asking Spencer Love month after month to stack them up. Well, this might be a mistake, though. I mean, it, in competitors, the caliber of Artemis Spencer and Nicole Matthews. Meanwhile, as you said, we saw we saw Mars the Specialist a little early. We saw how banged up he was, and he won that ladder match. Mm -hmm. We saw Ryder Dye last month take on Judas Icarus and Travis Williams defeating them. But the competition just... Doesn't keep, get any easier. Just keeps coming. Just keeps coming. But this is what they've asked for. They want to put themselves and show themselves as one of the best tag teams in Canada. Stephen Crow going to start this match off. Interestingly enough, Mars also started the match for their tag no, team no, right no. here tonight. Yeah. Oh, oh. Uh, maybe they're going to play some trickery. about underway. Artemis Spencer responsible for a lot of amazing talent that he has helped train. Spencer. Ref referee looking for a clean break. He's going to get it. I'm sure if the roles were reversed, that situation might have worked out a little differently. Stephen Crow, though, seemingly unimpressed. I mean, that was a brutal ladder match. He might not remember everything that happened. And I don't think he's had a chance to check the replay or anything, so... I can take a minute to call out the boots of Stephen Crow. He's wearing those boots. All around the elbow again. Crow with the headlock. But you will not out-wrestle Artemis Spencer. Sorry. Best in the game, headlock takeover. Yep. Crow down on the canvas. Mars was taped up. Stephen Crow does not appear to be taped up, so I'm sure everything hurts equally. I mean, all this Lionsgate Dojo does is just produce talent after talent after talent. Oh, but 
we talked about how Ride or Die were able to defeat Judas Icarus and Travis Williams also training at the Lionsgate Dojo, so maybe that was a bit of a practice match. Excellent point. Spencer again holding on to this headlock. Row able to reverse, but he's getting it shoved right off into the ropes. Whoa. Duck that big kick. Spencer dropping down on his back. Very interesting offense. Nice drop kick. This guy knows what he's doing. Round of applause from tag team partner Nicole Matthews. She looks pretty proud. She's impressed. Ain't no thing. Pro is asking for the official to yeah, have a word with our official here. I, I'm sure Artemis put a thumb in the eye. Well, come on. Maybe a little tug on the hair. He wants to have a talk with the referee about it. Taryn, she's holding on to that tag rope. She's waiting for the tag. This has been right down the middle so far. So far. Spencer. Takes the waist. Yeah, able to go behind. Uh oh. Shoved off into the ropes. Leapfrog. Hurled back into the ropes. Oh, man. Oh, right in the oh, face. Oh. Nicely done. Clean tag. Taryn looking to change the fortunes of the clandestine society. We're right into that octopus stretch. Extending that arm. Oh, crow from behind. Nicole Matthews doing her part, posing wonderfully. That is a lovely photo op for the social Just media. Just framing it up. <laughs> and fairly proud of themselves to say. Get the shout out there. I think that was for you, Veda. Very impressive. I'm impressed. Tag into Nicole Matthews, Terrence from right. accounting. Legal oh. Well, big shoulder tackle for Matthews. Long history between Terrence from accounting and Nicole Matthews. Yeah. Oh. Many promotions over many problems. Yeah. Matthews staying in control. Whoa. Shoulders are down. Taryn wanted no part of that, able to shift her body to get the shoulders off the canvas, reversing this iron whip. Wrist control from Matthews into the Russian leg sweep, up to her feet. Very nice, beautiful, impressive. And it's all Lions Gate Dojo so far. What can tag she do? Tag team title match. Oh! oh. Drop toe hold from Pro and gets dragged by those lovely boots. As I said last night, I've been friends with Nicole Matthews for longer than I've known Speedball Mike Bailey. Therefore, I will always choose Nicole Matthews as I did last night. And right now, I am cheering for Matthews and Spencer. Oh! oh. Artemis Spencer trying to cave in the chest of Stephen Crow. I mean, it's uh -oh. already caved in from last night. Aaron from accounting trying to come to the aid of her ride or die. Walked straight into an arm bar. Tandem submissions here from Spencer and Matthews. Ride or die all tied up. Triangle choke on the ankle. Oh! Wise oh, move from Stephen Crow. I'm using momentum to hurl Matthews into Spencer to break up both submissions. Yeah, maybe just keep the legal competitors in the match here. Matthews firing back on Crow. <laughs> oh. What's more painful, I wonder? Those kicks from Nicole Matthews are colliding with the ladder. Wait a second! Taryn was able to get rid of Artemis Spencer. Creative way. And now ride or die. Oh. Putting it together. Sliding Lariat from TFA, double cover, single cover. Matthews able to kick out. With the pendulum swinging back in favor of the clandestine society. You're they, right about that. Yeah, they have totally turned this around and managed to fully isolate Nicole Matthews. They need to keep her in that corner. Spencer trying to make his way back up onto the ring apron in his corner. Tag to Taryn. I just like to say that Taryn's new ring gear is money. 
Literally. See what you did there. Thank you. Now they are out of the corner. Oh! Not Kick just. through the spine and taunting Artemis Spencer. Kick out again for Matthews, but she's in no man's land. TFA trying to keep her body between Matthews and her partner. Blatant choke over that middle rope. Chokehold can be as blatant as it wants if she doesn't get if that ref doesn't count to five. Nicole just remains trapped in the wrong corner. Still to come, the LPW Grand Championship on the line. The winner of Larry's Lottery, Rose, going to take on Michael Richard Blaze for the biggest title, the biggest championship here in LPW. Stick around. Meanwhile, I believe there was a tag over in the corner of Ride or Die. We've seen this before. Stephen Crow likes to stack up his opponents on that middle rope. Another tag. Going to get an assist from his partner, and he's going to try to drive those knees in and cut Nicole Matthews in half. Oh, oh he did it. He did it. <laughs> Two halves. <laughs> That'll crack a rib. Two. <laughs> Just textbook tag team wrestling. They've got this ring cut in half. Yeah, great wherewithal for Math, and she's had to kick out of quite a number of near falls in the last Me few minutes of this matchup. Yeah, meanwhile, Spencer is on the corner reaching for Matthews, but she is far from making that tag. Stephen Crow making sure he knows it. Oh. I don't know if you want to ask Nicole Matthews if that's all you got. You'll find out. Crow fires back, but Matthews is right there. You said, you said you've known Matthews a long time. She's got a bad attitude and tough as nails. She is taking to Stephen Crow, who, to his credit, even showed up tonight after that ladder match. Uh oh. Matthews oh. connects! That might have hit the off button. Switch off. Just a lot of. Yeah. Finally, the tag. Artemis Spencer, legal. Stephen Crow wasn't able to tag in TFA. He's taken a lot of blows to the head. His equilibrium's definitely got to be off, and that's not going to help. Feeding in those knees to the midsection. Able to duck that kick, though. Fired in a knee of his own. He's trying to whip him into the corner. Crow starting to turn it around. Comes in hot, but Spencer out of the way. Just hurling the ball oh. into the ropes. Oh, just taking the wind out of Steve. Oh, where's our blatant cheating now, Boris? And Artemis was having fun earlier, but now there's a whole new sense of aggression. Get him off the ropes, That Rath. wasn't here earlier. Ride or die, collapsing to the canvas. Spencer takes off. Oh, drop kick through both of their faces. And a tag to Nicole Matthews. Looking to seal the deal here. And I think the clandestine society can see, can feel those titles slipping through their grasp. Oh. Assisted moonsault into the cover. Great tandem offense from the challengers. Not enough to get it done. Crow struggling to even get back up to his feet. Matthews here with the assist. Well, yeah, the mood changed. I mean, oh, yep. Spencer and Matthews were all smiles about five minutes ago. I was just going to say that. Nicole Matthews came out here with a smile on her face, but Beta Scott knows her well. There's always a nastiness bubbling under the surface of Nicole Matthews. Meanwhile, TFA was able to tag in. Oh! Man. Gets rid of Artemis Spencer. He's changing forearms. Oh! Another. And now we're down to Matthews and Taryn. Matthews up top. What does Taryn have in mind here? All the way to the... Oh! Matthews able to slide out, reposition the legs. Wait, there was a tag. Stephen Crow is legal. I don't think Matthews, Matthews doesn't knows. know, yeah. Yep. Oh, 
holding on to his partner, saving the bacon of Taryn from Brilliant. Dying. Brilliant. Now she's hung up down, upside down in the tree of woe. Great job, Matthews. Steven. Yeah, Matthews was looking for that spider suplex and is stuck. Steven Crow is legal. I'm going to see some knees. Oh, no. oh. oh stomp. Oh. Double oh. stomp to Nicole Matthews. Artemis Spencer has had enough. Yep. Powerbomb on the knees. Why are they allowed to just run in the ring and wrestle whenever they want without a tag? Now Artemis Spencer making the climb. Come on. We could be Get him out of the ring. From new champions. New champions. He should be disqualified. Get out of the ring. Now, Ter yeah, Terran's back up top. This will teach him for coming into the ring when he's not tagged in. Oh, ho, ho. wasn't accounting for that, was he? Head scissors, hurls, Spencer all the way across the ring and up to the floor. Twisting neckbreaker from Matthews. Over from behind, Stephen Crow. Rainbuster by Matthews. A little bit arrogant with that cover. You're going to want to get a deep cover when it's Steven Crow on the mat. Saving the titles for his team. Handful of hair. Matthews dragging Crow into the corner. Artemis Spencer just tagged in. Oh, oh. oh no. Kicked his own partner. Oh. Up on the shoulders. Tried for that poison Rana. Oh! Instead of face full of turnbuckle, and Spencer hits one of his own. What a counter. Terrence Artemis got, Spencer. Terrence got one of those championship belts. Tug of war over the cold, literally and figuratively. Wait! Oh, Stephen Crow just leveled Spencer with the other title. I mean, Nicole Matthews is trying to use this title over here. Spencer might be out. Oh! Kick down at two! Are you kidding me? Just a two. I'm not gonna lie, I thought it was made of end time. Ryder Die has a look of bewilderment on their face. Down to business. Go get Taryn. Taryn looking for that tag. She's now legal. Looks like TFA has a plan. I bet you it's crunching numbers, Veda. Matthews back up on that apron. Oh. Here we go. Tandem crunch. Wait, Spencer! Able to fight out of it! Oh. Did he get the tag? Shift his weight over the tag. Matthews in. Nicole Matthews back on the scene. Big Lariat. But she's not done. Now maintaining that risk control, repeated clotheslines to the accounting department of the clandestine society. Northern Lions floating over. Oh, into that cross arm breaker. Tara trying to get her fingers Here locked. comes Stephen Crow. Nowhere near. Oh. oh. This one way to break up. Yeah, Senton backsplash breaks up that submission. Big drop kick sends Crow over the top, out to the floor. And a Pescado Ooh. landing on his feet. I mean, he had to. Stephen Crow sidestepped him. Meanwhile, in the ring, Tarrant and Nicole. Tarrant holding on. Matthews trying to spin through. Sunset flip. Bro, hey, hey! Ah. Stephen Crow held on, and they got the three count. Genius! They did it again! You cannot outsmart the clandestine society. Month after month, ride or die prevails. Referee did not see the assist from Stephen Crow on that pitfall. And the clandestine society reign will continue. Yeah, as a reminder, Stephen Crow holding that championship belt that he just used a few moments ago to clock Artemis Spencer, that still wasn't enough to get the win. Hard fought match as finally 
behind the official's back. TFA with the win. Clandestine Society. One for two so far. Last time. Still have our main event to come. Yeah, thus far, no titles have changed hands here at LPW. Could Rose finally, finally turn the tide in these championship matches? It would be an upset in my mind that is to say nothing against Rose. But the way that things are going, it looks like the clandestine society will continue to stand tall 